everybody, I want to wheeze them here. It is Monday, November 23rd. I still have the torch light on, even though we had tapped it. And uh, had that to try and showcase custom painted Skyliner number 14, Blackberry Cinder, a little bit. I can't get it to show up on the camera, but trust me, in person, you see a lot of the purple through there. It's a very cool aesthetic. But what we're going to do now, I'm trying to think who I painted next. And I guess it doesn't matter too terribly much, but what we're going to do is we will just go with... Uh, let's go... You know what? I'll save the two I'm kind of the most excited about. So this was an interesting thing. It did not turn out like I had hoped it to. <laughs> and uh, it was supposed to have a video made, oh, back in September. Uh, that might tip you off to what we're doing, and if it does not, perhaps these will. So, this is Bumble Blast. This is his standard pose. Very cool, in my opinion. Very powerful Skyliner. I kind of thought we would see him back, but uh, since Vicarious Vision was on tap. But, he had uh, two poses in Swap Force. This is standard. This is his light core pose. Uh, so, you got to take both paths and everything. And, of course, I had several of him somehow, because I think I stocked up on Knockout Terrafin. Uh, which you can see back there behind Bop. Well, kind of. He's back there, sort of behind the Chaos Trophy. But uh, what we did, and I had, I, again, this has been so long ago, I don't exactly remember my goal here, but it didn't really turn out like I thought it would, and then I kind of just twisted it. It's sort of like Save Your Stump Smash over here. I was going to do a uh, pretty sweet thing. I still don't want to say what I was going to do because I think I will, but it just kind of turned into like an accent color for him. He looks very, very cool, especially side-by-side -side standard Series 2 Stump Smash. But joining him in the custom life element uh, Skylander ranks is Autumn Bumble Blast. I think I had named him something a little more catchy. Um... But for the life of me, I can't think of it. This is why I guess I should just make these videos when I get them done, when I'm actually kind of thinking about them a little bit more. But uh, what I came in and was doing, I think I was going to try to go like an orange and black color scheme. And then this always still reminds me of a golf ball. And uh, I debated going that route. But ultimately, I started throwing down different colors. And I just had like so many strange oranges and yellows. I was like, well, that's like Autumn Blast. You know, if they ever made, like, seasonal characters for the start of fall, maybe they get some weather buffs, you know, working at Toys for Bob or something. Uh, he does not look that great on camera. In person, he looks way better. It's got sort of like a, I mean, it looks like fall on a forest floor, basically. You know, is what this would do. I could go and I could throw him somewhere in an oak forest, and you would never find him because he would camo perfectly. Uh, unless he was light corn on a portal, then you might track him down. <laughs> so, what I did here, this is actually kind of a gold color. And I really don't like gold, but sometimes I use it. And I sort of nerfed it, washed it out with some green. I threw in a little yellow. Uh, again, it just it looks like a fall, sort of like a rustic look here. I believe that is the stock coloration. I might have glazed it with something. Uh, it's been so long, I can't remember. Uh, the hive here part of the gun, we painted orange. The rest of them, we just kind of washed out. I remember vividly mixing all the paint colors together. There's like brown, orange, yellow, red, a little bit of green, <laughs> some spring green. I just threw all kinds of crud together and mixed it, and this is what happened. And uh, I don't know, he does not look as good. I think maybe it's the lighting. Let's actually get our... Okay, well, you see it a little bit brighter there. You can pick up on kind of the golds and how vivid the orange is and everything. But the orange is by far the most vivid part, uh, kind of there on his jawline and the hive. And then the rest, it almost is like a fall leaf color. So, again, since it was Bumble Blast, I decided we would call it Autumn Blast. <laughs> and uh, it is what it is. So, I believe this was Custom Paint and Skylander number 15. Again, we just introduced Blackberry Cinder. Uh, let me know your thoughts on him. Again, I had so many of this guy just sitting around and I was trying to think of what to do with him. And uh, here he is side by side with his standard form. I'm kind of fond of the standard form myself, uh, particularly in this case, but... You know, you kind of want to be able to tell them apart, know who's on which path, things of that nature. This is an easy way to do that. I need to clean that up, actually, now that I see it. Very easy to do. I'm skilled in that area. <laughs> but, uh, nonetheless, let me know your thoughts here. Autumn Blast, Bumble Blast. Again, I do believe I had him a slightly catchier name, but that was the essential kind of like background behind him is I was going to make the video 
tail end of summer, the start of fall, back in September is going to be Autumn Blast, Bumble Blast, and be a big deal. But I couldn't because I had made other ones before, and I hadn't gotten to make those videos. But here he is. Let me know your thoughts. Hopefully you enjoyed it again. He is another one that looks better in person than on the camera. But so, uh, nonetheless, we got a couple more of these headed your way, so be on the lookout for that. Once again, thanks so much for watching. You can follow me on Twitch, follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook, circle me on Google+, whichever you prefer. If you've got custom paint and Skylanders, I encourage you to check out my full archive on oneofweasom.com. Similarly, take the link to the Skylander Club forum. I actually created an entire sub forum dedicated to custom Skylanders. So if you're into painting your Skylanders, chopping them up, putting on movable limbs, whatever it may be that you do with your extra Skylanders, feel free to sign up on the forum, post up. Everybody would love to see it. But for myself, an Autumn Blast, Bumble Blast, it's almost winter. We're like, what, less than a month away now, so we're still kind of in season, I suppose. But uh, once again, thanks so much for watching. We will catch you back here for the next Custom Painted Skylander.